caller is talking about a key article that we're going to cover more on the Sunday show coming up this weekend, 4 to 6 p.m. Leaked documents reveal Marine Corps Urban Training Center based on U.S. town. They admit they're training for taking over the U.S., NORTHCOM, the Army, the Marines, with the soldiers and Marines. But then they don't want us to be at these camps and training facilities. Well, I've shot video when they did this in, in major cities like Oakland and San Francisco before. And then Hebron, Maryland, small towns. What particular town is this base modeled after? We've got a lot of this uh, class of our restricted document here in the article, but go ahead and tell us. Uh, well, well, I can't... Uh I can't really say too much information on because I actually I, I have a 946 page document that's sitting inside of my house right now that kind of details a lot of this. Um, but you know, I was I was up here in Alaska when we had the whole Arctic Shield and DHS came in, and in the last week, man, there's been so many things going on up here with you know working friends that work on base and they have 22 hangars and they're reporting four and flyovers almost three and four a month as opposed to three and four a year. Um, things have really kind of ramped up over here. But with this Marine Corps town, um, I'm, we're, we're specifically talking about a, a, a coordinate. Uh, I, I can give you the eight-digit grid coordinate for it, or the 10-digit, rather. But it's a 63-building town uh, that takes up over a 1,000 acres. It's complete with a high school that has a gymnasium and a football field and soccer fields. And there's a big dirt road that runs all the way around the outside of this town. There's waterways that can be utilized for... Uh, rubber water craft training um there's there's just so many well, I mean, we've got an article out about the marine corps base at camp lejeune you're saying there's another town that it's built after or another secret training facility uh it's it, we're, we're 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 talking about something if you're referring to what's what's referred to as combat town um it's, it's going to be a very similar one to that. And, and I think that's the one that you're... Well, I mean, listen, let me ask you as a Marine, because I've been to the drills that are public where they admit it's for Americans, and that's in the news. They're trying to be secretive about these facilities and the Army facility. I mean, are they honest with you when you're training that it's for domestic operations? Here's, here's what they're training for, and here's what they tell us when we're talking about counterinsurgency. Now, mind you, they're training American... American personnel, American agents, DHS agents for counterinsurgency operations. Okay. And, yeah, and so to be clear, the Marines are training DHS, DHS agents to take on the American people. Uh, I wouldn't say they're training them to take on the American people. They're training them for anti terror, quote, quote, now use this, use this briefly or, or loosely, quote, anti terror and counterinsurgency operations. Sure, but when I've been to these drills, they're practicing killing guys in cowboy hats and John Deere caps. I, I mean, are they saying it's the Muslims, radical Muslims, or are they saying it's for the Tea Party? Um, let me use an excerpt from a DHS uh, a DHS file that was leaked uh, from you guys to the Oath Keepers up here in Alaska during Arctic Shield. The quote unquote Americans against socialist tyranny. Let's use that that term. Okay, uh, there's the organization that they they um, labeled Americans against socialist tyranny. Do you remember that? Yes, I remember that document. And uh, again, no, I know they're training to take on people that don't want to go along with the end of America. But, yeah, yeah. But this, this whole facility here, this whole facility is is very, very closely stylized after a specific town that within the last two years had a pretty major incident inside of this town. And like I said, I'm not going to say this word because there's there's a couple of things you just don't want to say over the phone and kind of catch a catch a computer's keyword, but there's a very specific Believe me, the buddy, North they're United. recording this. Anyways, no, no, I, I hear you. Look, this is all going on. We got 30 seconds left. Let me ask you this. Are the Marines doing this training? Are they clicking to what's going on? Um, we're, we're definitely, our eyebrows are going up and we're looking side to side like this can't be happening. Right well, look, now. it's foreign collaborators took over. So we've got to be honest about how bad it is. It's like going to the doctor and you learn you got brain cancer. I mean, we are screwed, but not as screwed if we wake up and say no. God bless you. I, everybody needs to speak out, folks, or it's over. We got to admit that it's a foreign enemy. See you back this Sunday. Sorry to other callers. Great job, crew.